Ringing in the ears, also called tinnitus or tinnitus, is a very common complaint. Unfortunately, there's no one size fits all answer to why you may be experiencing ringing in the ears. Tinnitus can present in many ways. For most people, they describe a ringing or a buzzing sound in the ears. For others, it sounds more like a car or freight noise. The ringing can be in one ear or both ears, and it can vary in the intensity or how loud it may seem. Most of the time, it's most noticeable when you're in a quiet space, when there's not a lot of background noise. Um, sometimes that ringing in the ears can be very distracting and can cause you to feel as though you're not understanding people who are speaking to you. Tinnitus is like a, a phantom noise. It occurs when the body doesn't have access to sound, particularly when there's hearing loss. We can then manage both the hearing loss and tinnitus, typically by using amplification devices uh, such as hearing aids or other strategies and masking devices. Unfortunately, there's no magic pill to reduce tinnitus. It is important, however, that we reduce any sort of overall systemic issues that could be contributing. This could be conditions such as diabetes or cardiovascular disease. These are conditions that are highly associated with tinnitus. Tinnitus is also very common with increased stress, poor sleep, as well as anxiety and depression. These are other conditions that of course can be managed with other specialties, but can also help reduce that sensation of tinnitus as those conditions are also managed. To learn more about tinnitus, please check out my new book, Mayo Clinic on Hearing and Balance, available at Mayo Clinic Press.